What's going on YouTube? Today we're going to be taking a look at the Microsoft Surface Pro. Now this is a 10.6 inch tablet um, that has fully dedicated Windows 8. Um, this is not Windows RT so you do have pretty much everything that a desktop can do. The device comes equipped with a 128GB hard drive as well as it is an Intel Core i5 processor running at 1.7GHz. Unlike the Surface RT which comes uh, ready with an NVIDIA Tegra chip, the Surface Pro does not have any dedicated GPUs. So as you can see, Microsoft actually does a pretty good job doing the packaging. Um, very nice colors used. With that said, a very simplistic design and a very simplistic unboxing. Right here you have your AC adapter. It's not too large and not too heavy. Um, the one thing that's good about this is it does have a USB port there for charging if you pretty much run out of uh, sockets in the wall. On the other end here we have our magnetic connector and this is very similar to Apple's MagSafe that they use on their um, MacBook lines. And I find I like these ones so much more just because of the sheer convenience and the size of the head. Taking out the rest of the contents, here we have our 10 inch tablet. Uh, it comes also with a startup guide and a warranty, although pretty much you don't really need to use the startup guide. All you do is just follow the on-screen instructions these days. Everything's made so simple. What's neat about the Surface Pro is that it includes a stylus. Now with that you can jot down notes or make edits just as easily as you would using uh, pen or paper. And uh, I find this is one of the things that I like the most about having the Surface. Now let's get into the 10 inch tablet itself. Uh, right off the bat I can see that this is very glossy and it's going to attract a lot of fingerprints. In the front here, there's a front-facing camera at 1.2 megapixels and it takes video at 720p. <clears throat> On the back here, we have a flip stand, which is extremely useful since you don't have to go out and buy a case just to prop up your tablet. We also have a rear-facing camera that is exactly the same resolution for video and images as the front. On the top, you have your power button and your air vent. Off to the side here, you can see that there is your power connector and that's actually the same port where you place your stylus for storage. Moving over to the other side we have a USB 3.0, your volume and your headset jack. This is all pretty much standard to a normal tablet. Thank you so much for checking out Alex Central's unboxing of the Surface Pro. The next video that I'm gonna shoot is going to be a demo as well as an unboxing of the type cover. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel because it helps us out so much. Peace! This latest generation of MacBook Pros are so incredibly thin. I didn't realize that it's only under an inch thick. Um, to be exact, it's 0.71 and it weighs about 4 pounds, which is crazy. So this laptop is extremely, extremely portable and lightweight.